so we're delighted to be here at uh, Yerevan Zoo uh, and we're, we're following um, our project to rescue the bears of Armenia and uh, this is our second visit to do the dental work and the mission this time was to uh, prepare the bears for release next month. We have a mother and two cubs that we want to release so we were able to do a complete inspection uh, of, of uh, the mother's teeth and the bears, uh, the cubs teeth and I'm delighted to say they were in very good condition which was a surprise. Um, so now we, uh, we went on and we did another uh, three bears so we've done six bears in all in two days uh, and we were then asked to come and help some uh, uh, two tigers that were in trouble uh, at uh, Yerevan Zoo with bad teeth and I'm delighted to say that we have an expert probably one of the best experts in the UK uh, to deal with uh, um, zoo animals and with our expert uh, veterinary dentists we'll be able to look at the teeth today and do any procedures that are required uh, to make the animals perfectly fit again. believe there are still another 50 bears that uh, are still in cages and we need to be able to uh, come back and we've got a, a long-term commitment with FPWC to rescue all the bears of Armenia but we need the help of the government too you know we're very happy to do the work and we're very happy to set up a center but uh, we really do need the help of the government to give long-term support to that center once the job is done not just the problem of the animals in captivity, uh, we also have a problem with hunting and a problem with uh, human-bear conflict and we've seen that with lots of bears being caught in snares and obviously mother bears shot and cubs are, uh, being orphaned. So it's a big problem which we need to look at holistically. Yeah, there's a good opportunity for us to solve this problem once and for all. <laughs> Quite good teeth, huh? Ah, that's, that's cool. the one. Nice position. So that's better. That's nice position and nice. That's nice. Beautiful. Yeah, fine. Um, that. Let's do the other side then. My first reaction to Yerevan Zoo was one that uh, I'm really quite opposed to zoos. I don't like zoos, uh, but in my opinion, Yerevan Zoo is one of the better zoos in the world. Um, we know that the director, uh, Ruben, is working very hard for the welfare of the animals, and I, I respect that. And so we are, are happy to uh, allow Ruben to look after the uh, lions that we rescued originally, which is why we first came to Armenia. Uh, and then once we'd finished with the lions, they're now in the zoo and very, very happy. Uh, so we decided to continue uh, to rescue all the bears. Um, so, you know, we're very happy to give um, any help that we can on an expert basis to help any animal suffering. So, uh, yeah, we're, we're uh, you know, we're very encouraged that the zoo is going on the right path and uh, will become one of the best zoos in the world, I hope. Yeah, I'm a little bit confused about the uh, demonstrations. Um, I know there are some personality clashes. One of the people I know, um, you know, in the demonstrations, um, and I think that, uh, you know, they're being a little bit misguided. We're very happy with the investments that we've made. We've spent 
some serious money, well over 250,000 euros now. Uh, and we're very happy that money's been spent in a very constructive way. I've been here several times myself to check. Um, we never invest money unless we're perfectly happy that it's being spent correctly. And uh, I'm very happy to continue with that investment. And uh, uh, I'm not really sure why these, these uh, demonstrations are carrying on. So it's a little bit sad.